Hello ladies and gentlemen, Fishburn here. This is a short video that will show all notable features with my personal thoughts from upcoming patch 2.6.5. It is a minor patch that doesn't add any new content and was made in the backyard in one day, just like the video you are watching now. We now have 5 extra tabs for PC players who wish to store all possible existed items in the game in a single place. Death Breath will now drop for bounty loot boxes, I mean uh, horadry caches. 22 bounty materials and 6 Death Breath from bounty cache at Torment 16. You can now track all seasonal objectives up to Guardian and receive new wings and also pet and portrait from season 5. One new useless item is Potion of Unfettered that removes control effects like being stunned, frozen or jailed. Exclusive PC feature item search and stash in case you can't find desired item among the mess. Unfortunately, item search works only for the current tab and you still have to click on each tab to find your item. Torment 14 16 now exists in equal to 65 75 greater rift difficulties. This torments obviously increase drop rate and experience. As for the keys, Torment 16 is currently equal to Torment 13 difficulty. It still drops on the 2 to 3 keys and 1 extra death breath from Elite. Also, the rift progress in town is shown only for greater rifts and doesn't sadly apply to Nephilim rifts. Once rift boss is dead, the place of death will be shown there. If your party member received little damage and procced extra life passive, you will see it at his portrait. And the final addition to this patch is that ancient or primal puzzle rings will lead us to the same but darker zone with more goblins inside. As for ancient or primal bovine, it still opens the same unchanged call level with two pools and chests. That is all for this minor patch 2.6.5, nothing special, new, just quality of life changes. Thank you for watching and listening, I'll see you around.